Our next guest has been on so many times in the past month and a half. I think he is after my job because he is dressed to impress today. It is comedian Mike Polk Jr., Cleveland's own. Michael. Welcome back to the show. No one wants your job. <laughs> <laughs> Just so you know. But thank you for noticing. <laughs> Thank you for noticing. This is my, I just got this at Unique Thrift Store. It's on Lorraine. I'm not a spokesman, but if you want to throw some used clothes my way, I won't complain. Well, you wear it well. Thank you, you so you, much. You, it still you. smells like the dead guy who left it there. <laughs> I can smell whatever he ate last. Oh, don't want your job either, No, Mike. nobody does. Uh, nobody all right. Does. You're known in Cleveland and actually throughout the country is making oh, well. these creative YouTube videos. That's now, true. I'm in marketing and, and I think that you'd be a great asset to use. You're a very creative person. I mean, when you, we should get I on mean, LinkedIn together. You are. I mean, even though you just put me down, I'm still right. going to give you a compliment. Thank you. Have you always been this creative? No, no, I haven't. This is something that, uh, that happened relatively uh, recently, actually. Uh, my whole life I was just not creative and then one day I was like, here I am, creative. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I was. I was Can always. Can you be serious no, for 30 I really seconds? Can't. I can't. I can't. No, I've, I've been making these videos for a long time since I was a kid before YouTube even existed. And it's just uh, people started paying attention to them eventually. And, and, it, and I'm happy that they did. And, and you have been quite honest about that you don't make really any money off of these YouTube videos. No, no, I don't. You're smart enough. You, you should be able to try to figure out how to make some money off of these. Are YouTube. you being like my life coach right now or yes. something like that? Yes. I know. You sound like my dad. <sighs> no, I, I appreciate it, Michael. Mike Polk Sr. I, I appreciate it, Michael. But, uh, you know, I, I just uh, I do it for the love of the game. And I actually brought one with me today that I wanted to share with you. Yes, and I, and I haven't seen it. And no. Has America seen it yet? America has seen this one. This has been around a little bit. It's, a, it's based on a, a local gentleman who's a, he's kind of a big goof, so I wanted to oh. kind of dig at him a little bit. And uh, you might have seen his, his commercials on uh, on TV for Tim Misney, the lawyer. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, yeah. Uh, why don't you take a look at this one? It's a big hit, so uh, enjoy it. Were you recently injured in an automobile accident? Did someone say something to you that you didn't like? Have you ever been hit by a train? Call me. I'm Tim Misney, and I can help. Have you ever had a brick fall on your head? That can't feel good. I will hurt them so bad. Did someone hit you with a shovel? I'll hit them with a bigger shovel. All I want to do is hurt people for you. I'm not even actually a lawyer. Shh. Ah. Bring that shot in closer. I just want to help you. Show me where they touched you. Ah. I will drink your enemy's blood. I said make the shot tighter. Who hurt you? I will put my evil inside them. Let me help you. I'm Tim Misney. Call me. Ah. I take it back. You're not creative. You're just sick. <laughs> oh, that was fun. I know Tim Misney. He's a big guy. You're calling uh, him a goof. What are you going to do? It's no big deal. He, I'm, sure it's, I'm sure he has a good sense of humor about it. But uh, yeah, it was a fun one. It took off locally. It got a little bit of play, and I was happy with it. <laughs> <laughs> Told you he's a big man. Hello, I'm Mr. out of this one. Hello, Mr. Misney. <laughs> Pleasure to see, sir. <laughs> you see the? You saw the thing. You know, I'm just going to... I was not aware that he was a guest today as well. What a treat. I think Ooh, I'm actually going to just let guy. you guys interview each other now. And I'm just going to sit down. I'll sit You're down not going here. anywhere. Yeah, okay, I will. I'll just sit right here. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't even. He scared me, and I don't even. Wasn't even really me that. Uh, Guess it was. It was me, yeah. <sighs> do, you, do you consider yourself sort of a good natured Christian person? <sighs> not today. I, this is really awkward. Is this awkward for you? <laughs> nope. What do you say we just put her there and make up? What do you say? You know what? Truth be told, Michael, I love this guy. Oh, you? I love this guy. It was all a charade. <laughs> <laughs> Happy New Year, brother. Happy New Year. Michael, I got to tell you, when, when this video first came out, I texted Mike Polk and I said, you're a comic genius. Well, you made me laugh so hard that for a whole seven minutes, I didn't feel like suing anybody. He did. <laughs> Thank you. Well, we gotta go. He'll make you pay. He'll make you laugh. Gentlemen, happy New Year. Thank you for coming on. Happy New Year, brother. Happy New Year. We'll be right happy back in the kitchen with Loretta Paganini. Man, love, right here. We'll be right back.